Newton's third law of motion states that when one object exerts a force on another object, the second object instantaneously exerts a force back on the first. These two forces are always equal in magnitude but opposite in direction. In this activity, we have taken two spring balances connected to each other. The fixed end of one is connected to a rigid support like a wall. The other is connected to a pan of weights suspended by a pulley. Both balances show the same reading. Increase the force applied on the balance by varying the weight on the pan. We can observe that the readings on both balances increase along with the weight and always show identical values on their scales. This means that the force exerted by the second spring on the first is equal but opposite in direction to the force exerted by the first spring on the second. The force which the second spring exerts on the first is called the action and the force of the first spring on the second is called the reaction. According to Newton's third law, we found that every action has an equal and opposite reaction.